Hi guys, it's Nikki. Today we're going to do a bowler cosplay from Clash of Clans. So this is my bowler cosplay tutorial and this is my first cosplay I have ever done. So right here you start off with bare skin. Um, the only makeup I really have on here is my eyeshadow from earlier today, but this gets all covered with orange paint later because the bowler has orange eyes. You start off with primer, the, all that random shit I just put on my face. It's really not necessary. This is just a barrier to protect the makeup paint absorbing into your skin and it reduces the size of your pores. In the clip earlier, you see my cat Molly running around my desk, but uh, I can't really have them covered in purple, so you know, I kind of throw them off. But uh, I tie my hair up so I am able to put my hair in a bald cap. Uh, the more proper way to do it, if you wanted better results, you would cut up the bald cap and you glue it down. So that way it makes it look a little bit cleaner and you won't see the front of the bald cap as much. I move on to painting my body here. This is the longest portion of the cosplay. This generally takes about an hour and a half um, because you have to wait for it to dry between coats. But this is extremely sped up. So it looks like I finished this in like two or three minutes, but it takes about an hour and a half to two hours. The paint uh, does come off very easily, just like rinse of water, soap, just like a normal shower, if you gamers understand what I'm talking about. You also don't really have to worry about it staining your jewelry, like uh, as far as bracelets, earrings, um, necklaces, it all rinses off. I will also link all these products under on my YouTube description if you decide to want to also become a bowler as well. For now, I'm gonna go ahead and let this video run through the painting and then I'll go ahead and talk my eye, about my eye makeup in a little bit. So right here, um, this is where I start my eye makeup. This is just a orange makeup paint that I found on Amazon. It looks a little bit light on camera, but it's definitely more pigmented in person. Um, so while that eye makeup is drying, I do go in with another coat of the purple paint. Um, this is just to make sure that everything looks smooth and there's not really as much patchy areas. Um, I also go ahead and put on my e.l.f. ears that I got off Amazon so that way it kind of matches or mimics the way the bowler looks. As I am applying a second coat of the orange eye makeup, I will later go in with my Morphe eye makeup palette. You'll see that very shortly as I'm trying to air myself off. Um, the Morphe palette, I go in with like the reddish color so this way this will make the orange a little bit more pigmented like the one um, you see in the top left bowler picture. I also added some red tint from my eye makeup or sorry my lipstick so that way it makes the orange look a little bit less bright and a little bit more dark. And then I do add on like a very little bit of eyeliner just to enhance like my eye area. So towards the end here, I'm just kind of drying myself off and then you will see that I do have a boulder with me. Um, it is a styrofoam circle sphere ball thing I got from an arts and crafts store. I was able to cut into the shape of the styrofoam into a boulder shape with a piece of a bread knife and then I spray painted it gray. It took about two coats of spray paint and boom! There you go, that is my polar cosplay. Thank you guys so much. 